Bonjour, c'est Virginie and you are watching French Trolley TV, your destination to truly become a little bit French. Today, I am bringing you a passionate love affair of two top intellectuals of 18th century France, but I'm going to focus on the women to restore some justice in this world. I know that you know him, and I also know that you don't know her, but I bet you'll want to know everything about her when you're done with this video. Vous êtes prêts? Imagine the state of 18th century France right before the explosion of the 1789 French Revolution. Imagine the century of enlightenment. In French, we say le siècle des Lumières, that moment where people started questioning the authority of the church and the state. That moment when people started to fantasize on what would soon become our French motto, liberté, égalité, fraternité. Today, I'm going to change this for you and introduce you to one of the greatest geniuses of the 18th century. And yes, you have guessed, she was a woman. Everybody knows Voltaire, the witty philosopher that mocked the establishment and dreamt of liberty. But who knows the great love of his life, Émilie du Châtelet? Nobody, nobody knows her. Let me tell you that if Emily had been a man, her name might be more popular than his. You have to read this book. It's called Passionate Minds and it was written by David Bodanis. It's fascinating and really fun to read. Here are four facts that will make you want to read this book. Number one. As a girl, Emily outed all of her teachers, so she ended up having to fight to acquire her own books and teach herself very complicated mathematics and physics. Two, she ended up number six in the competition of the year organized by the Académie des Sciences in Paris. Now, you might think number six isn't that impressive, but you need to know two things. First of all, her ideas and calculations were actually way too advanced for the man of the Académie des Sciences and then of course she was a woman and had to pay the price for that. Three, her years of work and research paved the way for Einstein's theory of relativity. And four, her wits and intelligence rescued Voltaire from life-threatening situations several times. These two were outstandingly intelligent people. However, Voltaire admitted that he could not do any work of value without her support, her love, and mostly her respect. If you like this French love theme video, stay tuned because next week I'm going to teach you seven French idioms about love. And of course you can join our two French events, How the French Invented Love on February 19th and French Movie Night on February 26th. I'm adding the link underneath this video. If you missed last week's video called Unusual Ménage à Trois, click here. And if you want to see more videos like this one, click here. This was your French friend Virginie helping you become a little bit French. Merci beaucoup. Au revoir.